Welcome to Creating a Safer Workplace by MSC Direct, featuring the web series Nothing Stops U.S. Manufacturing, conversations with safety professionals in the field. Here's your host, Anthony Testa. I'm joined today by Chris Smith, Director of Marketing for MCR Safety, one of the premier manufacturers of PPE. And Chris, I just want to have a conversation with you about what is really the driving force behind MCR and their, um, their innovation to market for PPE products? We have the only ISO certified testing lab in the US that is certified to the ANC 105 test method to make sure that we're bringing product to market that not only states that it's a cut level A4, a cut level A6, uh, that, that says that, you know, that actually backs up the claim that it's an ANSI high impact rated glass. We've got all this testing facilities in house. So we can take new fibers, we can take new products and make sure that we're putting product out there that is not only uh, innovative, but also is safe. Because it, let's, let's face it, our industry is changing. Um, your your oh, customers yeah. are changing. Um, they're, they're identifying new, new processes, new technologies. And with that, we have to keep our product, our PPE, changing and, and, and adopting to their changing environment as well. Give me some examples of some of the innovations that you've, brought, you've been able to bring to market with MCR, um, some of the technology that you've, you've innovated over the years, um, and what you guys Give me a little bit of a glimpse behind the scenes, behind that curtain on what's coming out in the very near future. Um, through our manufacturing and what you're going to see come forth down the future um, will be products that are lighter weight, finer dexterity, and stronger fibers. And then also we utilize our capabilities from a, a eye and face protection by putting out some of the newest technologies when it comes to anti-fog. Um, you're going to see, and you and you probably have seen recently, MCR Safety launched the first ever UV anti-fog technology. Um, and again, it ties okay. back to us having products that you can take to market that not only protects our workers, but also protects our planet. As more and more people in the workforce are, are forced to wear masks, right? So disposal masks or those cloth masks. How important is it for that, you know, the anti-fog technology that you're just, you referenced before, how important is that now more than ever? And what have you done to like really get it to that next level? Extremely, extremely important. One of the biggest issues when wearing respirators or face mask in general is the, is the fogging concern. Um, and with our UVA, AF, anti-fog, and more importantly, the, our MAX-6 anti-fog coating systems, um, that's, that's, that's available in your, um, in your lineup today. And when, when you think about safety, you never want to remove a, a, a set of PPE from your body if you can help it, unless you're going on break or ending your shift. The minute you take off a safety glass or the minute you take off a glove is when an injury can occur. There's the OSHA puts out stats, you know, the, the average injury, eye injury a day is around 3,000 eye injuries a day. Wow, uh, and and it's it everything from 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 small micro particles to to chemical uh, issues, um, and if we can if we can allow that user to keep their protective eyewear on their face, while they're keeping staying safe from the current COVID situations, then I think it's a win win. We know MCR makes great products, right? That's that's the backbone of who MCR Safety is. But let's talk a little bit about let's shift this conversation a little bit about the assessments that you can provide to the end user and also provide that cost savings documentation. Can we talk a little bit about that? And just give me that, that process that your team works through along with the distributor partner? For sure. Yes, we have a, a, a dual system called the MCR Safety 360. And the reason why I say it's dual, because we have adapted to the virtual environment as well. So we can perform this assessment in person if a facility will, will allow us to, or we can, uh, we can perform it virtually. Wow. utilizing Zoom and some of the latest software out there right today um, for, for video chat. Um, and this, this process is a five-step process. And it basically starts out in a, an evaluation phase, measure, analyze, execute, and protect. And through that five-step process, we are looking at multiple aspects as we are going through and, and, and really analyzing a user's hazards, analyzing their job functions, and, and analyzing their injury rates. And we do that through this cost calculator. And, and, it, and what it does, it analyzes both indirect savings as well as direct savings. Through this 360 analysis, 
I can show you that a that, that product will last two to one, three to one, four to one, five to one, depending on the job task, by utilizing some of this some of this newest technology that's out there. But it's a it's a great tool from an overarching standpoint to look at an entire scope of what are you what are you using today? How is it how is it protecting your employees? How safe is it? Are you having injuries? And that this, let's let's analyze it through our five step process. So just explain to me a little bit about so, if someone's a little bit reluctant about letting um, MSC and MCR in the door to do a safety assessment. How do they go about doing either? We can help them do a self assessment, or we can do something. I think you mentioned before you could do it virtually. Correct. Yeah. So um, we do have our 360 tool that's available in a uh, in a standard PDF form format that will allow your customer to print it off and, and basically walk them through step by step. Um, the other method uh, that you mentioned is virtually. And whether we do that through FaceTime, Teams, WebEx, Zoom, whatever you know avenue, uh, we have the ability to do that. And so if, if, if a user, if a safety manager is willing to let us physically see a process, uh, then we can on the fly give them a recommendation right there on the spot. And then at that point, we can prepare the 360 information, prepare the report, and, and submit a sample request and, and partner with MSC to make sure that those samples are delivered and make sure they're tested, trialed, and analyzed to make sure that that was the right suggested product for that, for that application. So, Chris, um, let's talk a little bit about the, the and I hate this term, the, the quote-unquote new normal, right? So, what does that mean, what does that mean to MCR in terms of, how you have to rethink the PPE world and what are you as a manufacturer doing to either enhance those products or bring more products to life in this quote unquote new normal beyond just the traditional PPE? The smartest method is to find a product that you can sanitize um, and, and ultimately try to get a reuse out of it. That's what we're looking at from a product development standpoint, um, because that, that seems to be drive the part of the driving force right now is how do I get reusable PPE that, that I can still protect my employees with and, then, and, and that they know they have peace of mind that it's been sanitized and that it's and that they can reuse it. So, yeah, I mean, if you just tie that back to that, that we our discussion before about cost savings, right? So that's one of the key element. I mean, people from a disposable standpoint, that gets fairly expensive very quickly, right? Especially in today's environment where you see a lot of the disposables and anything, right? So if you're seeing that that those prices rise in the market, coming and doing something with a reusable. And so, like you mentioned, that can be disinfected is a home run for the end user. Yes. Yes. Agree. Yep. Agree. Chris, you're a passionate guy. What motivates Chris Smith to say, you know what? I love this and I want to keep people safe. I had an end user walk up to us um, at a trade show and I shook my hand and, and just said, you know, I just want to tell you that MCR safety, you had a salesperson that visited me and solved an issue that I have been facing for 30 plus years. I have not been able to find a glove that I could perform my job with. I've had multiple manufacturers in here and nothing, everything failed, but you guys found a solution. And because of that, I'm, I'm able to feel things with my hand that I haven't been able to feel before because the calluses are gone. I can hold my wife's hand I can hold my grandkids' hand because my hands are not are not are not tender. They're not sensitive from from working all day with them. So when that when people ask me what I do, I don't tell them I'm a glove manufacturer or I'm a glass manufacturer. I tell them I'm a what do you what do you do for a living, Chris? We protect people. I protect people, and we do that through avenues of utilizing PPE, glove, glass, and garments to do that. So uh, those are a couple examples that that I personally had, and there's there's many more, but. Um, that's why I wake up every morning and come to work with a smile because I know that somebody's going to wear our product and somebody's going to stay safer because of it. That's awesome. Chris, I want to thank you very much for joining us today. This is a great conversation. Uh, I wish you all the best. Make sure you stay safe, please. You too. And this was, this was Anthony Testa. Thank you very much for joining us today for uh, MSC's Nothing Stops U.S. Manufacturing Series. Thanks. Thank you. Follow us at msdirect.com for future episodes and more information on operating in our new normal.